Hello, hello, guys. Today we're going to talk about this Singer Imperial. This series is Imperial 7000, in this case, is 7000. But they are so similar. If you have one of those, Imperial is how work these machines. You can realize from here, this single dial and the stitches in the top. We have here the off on. We have here the leg. And this is the reverse, I push. Had auto tension and it depends if you want to use another tension you just move the thing but I let in auto it's there this one is really important because this is the width when we use double needle twin needle once coming two needles there, you want to put this in here. Never go the width to the maximum width. That means you can use there if you had double needle or twin needle. When you use twin needle, the maximum, maximum width is where is the two needles it means is this happened a long time ago when i had one of those and i trying to use twin needle and i push this to the right all the way with and of course broken the plastic pressor food or broken the needle so don't go in to do that please if you are with a single needle, like I am right now, single needle, yes, you can go with the width, the maximum, and the right side, okay? This is for this part. When it's a buttonhole, you can come here and let in this mark. This is the mark. And when you are in a straight stitch, you use a stretch here. We're going to see after how it works with this machine and how to thread the machine. Now we can see another feature is our hiding little compartment and all the accessories. And maybe you have one of those and never open. Well, it's time to open and check in. And these kind of machines, you realize there are no uh, wind in the bobbin like uh, all the machines had over here. This is doesn't hurt because the wind in the bobbin is built in inside the bobbin. Is there? We're going to see that how do that too. The bobbins this machine use is Centauro. This little triangle go always in the top. And we had these machines use a slant chunk. I explained in another video. Subscribe to my videos. You can find also how cleaning these beautiful machines and get ready for so. Okay. Now, the pedal is this one. But there are also generic food. Uh, the thing here is there. The one in the top is a single. I can't really take up that, but it's going in 
tu sei per giù tu c'è che ne giù ma c'è the one in the button is for the long the power and the one in the top is a single pin and is for the pedal you see the model is in here all these models this model is 7000 i already like i told you cleaning and is working like a champion going to see how use these machines i tried to find um a owner manual i didn't find for this machine but i had a manual is for series 7000 i can leave you in the descriptions all in english for you to check in how we use this machine now we're going to start turn on the machine here i show you here it's on now remember when i say the right hand and the hand well is in here this is something always we need to do with all our machines is because that master of handling our needle down and up and it's important doing that for now always let in the high position the needle and for thread the machine we're going like this first notice there are this cap had two sides when is a uh, the thread is being one i can use this side when is the small thread i just put for this side when is the small the bigger part for the biggest one so it's double use go horizontal remember always the thread go take the thread and your right hand and the tail go in your left hand the same way you come in here like that and the thread come in like that in front of you in this case because this thread is here we just push there remember don't let that loose because the idea is this get really in close there okay doesn't matter because in the end what is going to do is coming is like this the idea is not the move the thread is move over front now with your two hands take the thread and pass here a little push and is there doing this that means the thread is soft throw this part you don't need to put the thread under to the button there no use is in the top of the thing show you very well it's important that i tell you this because happened to me and i don't want to pass for you so i saw what's going here in the button but no it's just in this little circle in the top this is where go the thread like that okay now continue going there are error here continue for the error down pass over here the thread go here and now you see the error go around like a u u like that coming
is in here. This no had more other 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 parts for just go down and to the eye of the needle. Remember my oil all school for my mom is use saliva saliva in the thread saliva in my finger put my finger in the bag or the eye and thread it's a good one all is cool <laughs> really good no? okay guys now Here, how we going to put the bobbin? I going remember, remember, please never take off this plate. No, the plate just coming under here. Don't trying to push this plate outside because it's going to damage the bobbin window there. So just let like that. When Say I going to change my bobbin because I don't want this color. Take the bobbin. And you see how go? The triangle is in the top, and the little like a cross is in the bottom. Hmm? It's like that. So put the other bobbin. Remember the triangle in the top. And here, when you're going to put the bobines already with thread, you just throw here, pass for the first is here, I hope guys you can see because there are a second and number two is in here, it's almost not perceptible but it's there, it's number two. So, come here, the triangle is in the top, now come here, under this lash, take the thread to the right, to the right, and in the two, there are another little lash here. Here, just push the thread and is there now I'm going to finish the that thread is outside you don't need to close the needle play or the bobbin cover just take your top thread and your right hand like that go down right hand in the hand well and down the needle down and that cash you see is here you can do that with the presser foot there or no just i tell you before just for show you how to put the presser foot but doesn't matter it is in or no the presser foot here is is not on you just pull the middle, this bridge, this need to be in the center on our adapter. There, exactly there. Now, lead on the rest, the presser foot, and down the presser bar. You see, with the, the, the lash is in the back, you just down until you find a place and help your finger put in your screw here and push you hear is there now 
up again the bar and is there always the two threads go like a sandwich in the middle the needle play and the presser foot is there now you can close and start to sew but we're going to make another thing is this is in case when you had thread in the bobbin but say you don't have thread in the bobbin you're going to put an empty one you just pull there you can put this over there over in front like that okay there throw there it's a beautiful feature i like how this thread now this push the play you're going to push and let in this mark you see the like a transparent error here i need to go with this arrow for the play you're going to hear a little clip there it's engaged just like that it's a little open here and the two arrows face to face the pressure bar is up not down is up now You're going to make just one. This a uh, the screw was a little loose. Okay, for whatever, like that. On the other side, it's just like that. And doesn't matter the leg or this. This pattern need to be yes. The pattern need to be in a straight. So we. This deal, you're going to push, looking where it is, in zigzag, and just turn to the left, and I get in straight. Doesn't matter, this, the width, no more. Just is that. Just let in a straight stitch, and press her foot, in the press her foot, and not too, too high speed, just normal. And you're going to see it's working because the thread here is going, you see. It's doing. This a lot of thread can go there. It's a good bobbin, really. Okay, say I don't want more. Use if the needle is down, you just pull up. This is cash already. The one was in the screw, is the thread is already cut. Now the thread is under the presser foot. You just take with something. Take and cut there like that. And you have the two threads. You need to close now the the lid for the coming for the bobbin. Okay? Is there? Really easy, it's a good feature, I think, for these machines. Now, a little soy is too easy. Remember, this is not hard. The, the feature about feet dogs down, because for feet dogs down, we're going to use a cover. Uh, we can do that in the next video. For now, just I'm going to show you for so it's like that, and take your fabric under. It's in a straight stitch. It's straight, and we're going to put in lead, say two, and 
the star. Food in the pressure food. Reverse. Now we're going to the zigzag. Well, now we're going to see beside what zigzag you want. How narrow or width you have for the zigzag. Say I want the bean zigzag and I want like uh, in leg number one is the steps. Now I want zigzag a little bigger than step number two now i want six a in number three now i want six a number four remember when you do that the needle need to be up never change your stitch when you have the needle down now we can check in and see about the steps you see each step is number one here for the leg, leg number two, number three, and number four. Now we can change if you want, say, decorative, whatever is in here, to see how we go. That go there. Now, say we do this one, it's like arrows. We want the width like that, it's okay. And we want the leg between zero and one. Because that need to be a steps, a small steps. Two. Now we want Domino, Domino is this one stitch, let in between zero and one, and with the maximum width. And it's the way how you go through the, all the stitches, always when you change the stitches, remember the needle need to be up, never down, please guys, always up. Now, this is how so, so beautiful, huh? Okay, guys, it's all about this machine for now. Next video, I'm going to show you about monograms, how you can make monograms with this machine. Yes, we can do it. Okay, God bless you. Please, guys, continue pray for the world. God Almighty, His Holy Spirit, Jesus Christ, with all of you guys, fill you with love, with peace, with happiness. God bless you. Bye, guys.